Yo, and what is going on, YouTube, and welcome to another FIFA 17 player review where we take an in depth look at the 88 rated legend Yari Littman. And if you guys have been enjoying the reviews, please go ahead, hit that like button, and subscribe if you've not already. Also, if there are any players you'd like to see, go ahead and leave a comment down below. Well, let's go ahead and take a look at his overall record for me. Now, I did pay around 340,000 coins on the Xbox forum, and Littmanen played six games, scoring two goals with three assists. Now, I applied the engine chem style to, him to increase his pace, passing, and dribbling, but let's go ahead and take a look at his in-game stats, guys. He's got... He's got 94 positioning, 89 finishing, 86 long shots, 90 volleys, 86 ball control, 88 short pass, and 87 stamina. That ultimate professional, injury prone, and finesse style free kicks traits, as well as the clinical finisher and playmaker specialities. Also those high medium work rates, the 3 star skills, and 4 star weak foot guys. Now the first pro on the legend Litmanen has got to be his shooting guys. Now. I only scored two goals over the six games, but holy shit, on another day he could have been on eight, ten goals. His right foot is so lethal. The power that it has, it's an absolute cannon. Get the ball and from anywhere really you can trouble the keeper because he has amazing long shots. And honestly, more often than not, I just tried shooting from range because I wanted to get those beautiful long shot goals. The other thing I wish I'd done with this card is use Hunter Chem style. Um, but for some reason I just went on to use Engine. Now the second pro for Litmanen is his ability to break down the defense guys. His positioning and ball distribution is absolutely class. He's always seemed to be moving into open lanes for the easy press and then he could just chip a ball into my strikers or have a shot from range. Those high medium work rates he's going to sit nice and high and be ready to turn an attack. Now the third stat which seemed to stand out for me was his stamina guys. Now I know a lot of you have complained to me about legends and their low stamina getting tired in the 60th minute but really with Littmanen I never seemed to notice this. He was able to go 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 for the whole game and he never lost the step for me guys. Now he was a lot of fun for me to use but he did have a couple of cons and the first would be his lack of the 4 star skills. You guys have heard me complain time and time again about lack of skills and at Cam I just think it's one of the most important positions in this formation where you have someone that's full of tricks and Littmanen was a disappointment in that area. The other would be his dribbling in general. Although he has decent ball control, he just felt kind of clunky weaving in and out of players. The only other con I would have is his physical. Now he is a fairly large presence, I believe he's 5'10", but with only 69 strength, he, uh, he doesn't have that strength that someone like Rui Costa has. Now, at the price of around 350,000 coins now, would I say he's worth it? Honestly, guys, I had a freaking blast playing with this Litmanen card, and those long shots are absolutely class. And I rate him really highly as a cam. My only hesitation is the lack of the 4-star skills. But for 350k for a legend that links with anyone, and you can build a sweet throwback Ajax club, guys, absolutely, I'd give him a shot. So that does bring us to a close on our review of the 88 rated legend Yari Littman. And if you guys have been in any players that you'd like for me to review, please leave a comment down below and I'll start to make my way through them. And thanks for stopping by guys. If you haven't already, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button because what else you gonna do? Check you guys later.